Hey guys, it's Sue Tech, and what's going on? It's Friday, 27th of July, 9.13 a.m. And uh, I have some fantastic news about Electronium and Next Exchange to give you guys. Uh, I just want to give it to you real quick. Electronium and Fiat is going live probably sometime this weekend. All right. Next Exchange is testing the Fiat Electronium Exchange. And uh, I got word back from the Telegram that it's going well. It basically 100% works. They just want to test it a little bit more, and then it's going live. So that could be today, it could be tomorrow, it could be um, Sunday, Monday, but it's going to be very, very soon. I'm guessing over the weekend sometime. So that's fantastic news. As you know, uh, Electronium's Coinbean entrance has been postponed until next week so I don't know I don't really don't know if that affected the price at all maybe it did I don't know but uh, nonetheless it's off until next week so this is great news now I believe you will need a hundred next exchange tokens to get on so you have to go to IDEX buy a hundred next tokens and you'll be able to get on um, but that should alleviate a lot of the problems people have with buying electronium. A lot of people don't like, it's supposed to be a very simple coin to buy or use because it's supposed to be the mass adoption coin, right? But people still have trouble getting it because they have to go through all of these different exchanges to get there. So it's supposed to appeal to the masses and one way to do that is make it easy to buy obviously so this does that next exchange is going to make it very easy to buy electronium be able to buy it directly off of PayPal you don't have to worry about Bitcoin you don't have to worry about Ethereum and transferring it you just buy it straight direct from PayPal so that's great news and that's going to change the price action because it won't need Bitcoin now so that's very underrated news guys very underrated news and i want to talk about the one of the ETFs was rejected there we go Winkle Voss Twins second Bitcoin ETF uh was rejected and CME's rejection of altcoin futures all of which really don't matter guys I mean I'm not gonna say well I shouldn't say it doesn't matter but there are five more Bitcoin ETFs that are up for debate that'll have decisions in September okay so this is just one of them but there are much better ETF applications out there that are have a uh, get a decision in September so it shouldn't even affect the market at all all right Winkle Boss twins are two individuals applying for a Bitcoin ETF all right there are ETFs with actual companies behind them so I'm not worried about that you know five more are up one will get through the best one they'll probably want to weed out all of the weak ones and are looking for the best one so they got rid of Winkle Boss Twins ETF early which means it was probably the weakest link so I'm assuming they're gonna pick one or two strong ones and then uh, go from there Uh, all coin futures I could see why that was rejected because all coins are totally dependent on Bitcoin price action for the most part so that would have been a total crapshoot so that's that's not an issue with me at all um, 
Dab, huh? Switch blockchain dab. Hopefully it doesn't get associated with Devor coin. Because that would not be a good look. And uh, everything's down today. It's a Binance coin. <laughs> oh, but for the most part, everything's down. Mostly off that news, from what I understand. So, you know, it's going to be a weekend to buy, you know, buy low and uh, play the swing. And get ready for ETN, Fiat, and keep, a, keep an eye out on it, because it should happen today or tomorrow. Uh, let's take a quick look at token pay. All right, token pay, super cheap. Three dollars and thirteen cents right now. <clears throat> One thing I don't appreciate is even the token pay kind of talking about things that sh they shouldn't even bring up. Don't even bother talking about this type of stuff. <clears throat> you don't want to get on anyone's hate list or radar for no reason. Okay, but this is good news. Launching the first ever privacy coin certificate. Three other security driven coins. Token pay is ahead of the curve. They're way ahead of the curve. The best part about Ethan Exchange is we never ask you to trust us. So it's totally peer to peer. And they don't actually control any assets. It's just kind of like a middleman or a meeting spot, so to speak, where you can exchange. So. Um, they have all the right ideas, but I just don't like when they bring up government or try to clash with government regulators because that's, you don't want to bring unnecessary heat. That's all I'm trying to say. Where's basic attention token? All right, still 43. All right, it's down to 30 cents. So it's pretty cheap right now. Be good to grab some. But uh anyway guys, that's the update for today. Take care. Uh have a great Friday and I will talk to you tomorrow. Peace.